Kunugigaoka School of Magic, where students from all over the world come to forge themselves into heroes. We're E-Class, outsiders, underdogs, and we share a secret no one else in the school knows. This year, our teacher just so happens to be the Demon King. Alrighty, take your best shot. Another day with the one and only Koro Sensei. Here goes nothing. Okay, my goal, boys and girls, is to train a war party capable of giving the Demon King a run for his money. To get started, we need some heroes. However, I'm sad to say there doesn't seem to be anyone here who meets that criteria. Uh, but there's Iso guy! Granted, between his leadership skills and undeniable courage, he does have a certain heroic streak. There's just one problem. In his case, the phrase heroic streak has an unfortunate double meaning. Harsh! Okay, then, if Iso guy doesn't fit the bill, then who do we have that does? Not to put too fine a point on it, but... Wah! That defeats the purpose! So what are we supposed to do? Well, when the conversation turns to Mighty Warriors, three names never fail to be brought up. How long have you been standing there? I recommend enlisting the three of them to your ranks. The first is said to dwell in a northern cave and call himself Karma, a.k.a. the Red Devil. Legend has it his abilities are way above average. I've heard of that guy. Yeah, he's supposed to be a super sadistic ranger type, I think. It's sort of hard to believe we have a living legend in our own backyard. The second is Ritsu, known as the Evolved Mage. Dwelling in a northern cave, her magic is rumored to evolve on a daily basis. Third is the Silver Berserker, Itana. The story goes that deep within a northern cave... Just how many northern caves are there? Coral Q. Ah, don't try to hide it, Tessa! Remember that birthday money you asked me to keep safe? Yeah, Mama treated herself to the Korean spa. No! Coral Q. Here we are, class. The secret lair of the Red Devil. Secret? Yeah. Okie dokie, hand these out if you would, please. One each. What are these, boat anchors? The strategy guide for this dungeon. Everything you need to know compiled in one handy-dandy manual. Maps, monsters, treasure chests, save points. You name it, I've got you covered. No self-respecting dungeon raider should be without one. <laughs> Isn't being on the attack side of things exciting? So exciting. Uh... The sealed portion of this book deals with more adult monsters. We talked in parental advisory stuff? And, of course, the final page lays out details regarding the dungeon boss himself. What does irregularities in his luck trait mean? I was about to ask. <laughs> All bark and no bite, huh? You could live a bazillion years and not get close to beating me. Ah, yes. You see, when Karma thinks his opponents are beneath it... <laughs> That's right, Fleabags. Laugh it up while you can. After that, go run back to the shelter and get yourself euthanized. The effect on his luck is rather negative. <laughs> That's his bug. When he acts cocky or looks down upon someone, his luck takes an astronomical plunge. Oh, I get it. Karma! A shame, really. Oodles of potential. He'd make a great warrior if not for the disagreeable tendency to lord his prowess over others. <laughs> Kinda like what you're doing right now, you mean? Wow, this place is crawling with booby traps. Dude must be a total sadist. Not that his handiwork's gonna do much to slow down Koro Sensei. A little poison ought to dial up the danger quotient a notch. We still have to walk through those, you know. And these blase blades are simply screaming for a much needed artistic makeover. We, we don't, don't need that, that kind of danger. danger.
Questing through a dungeon is a lot easier with someone like Koro Sensei blazing a trail out ahead of you. But where are the monsters? Heads up! Monster incoming! An adult one? Dang it, never mind. Huh? Wait, they're in the strategy guide. Right, so apparently these guys only smile when they see lower level adventurers. <clears throat> Ouch! That's obnoxious. <laughs> like Moss? It all over the place. Are we in trouble? Not to worry, children. Monsters can't attack the final boss. He'll be fine. <laughs> 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 Karma. The boy was incognito, ingenious. He actually heard him. Am I wrong, or does that make him the first? And here I thought Koro Sensei was a play in the Japanese for unkillable teacher. Guess the teacher part was true at least. Anyway, impressive bob and weave you pulled there, Freddy Cat. Oh, come on! Personal space, What's wrong? Please. Are you scared? Do I intimidate you? I'm gonna need you to step off! Karma! Oh, man, that is one serious bug. Worst luck ever! Sure, but still, he did land the first blow. Good to know he isn't all hype. <laughs> Balls. Um, is he punching a wall? People actually do that? Miss Smack Talk seems to have really touched a nerve. Got a little careless there for a second. No disrespect, Chief, I'm just surprised the Demon King's such a featherweight. <laughs> well, well. Hey, Nagisa, what's up? It's been a while. Uh, long time no see. Whoa, whoa, say what? Oh. We've known each other since we were kids. So, uh, how the hell are you bottom feeders kicking it with the final boss? Damn, Sigburn on Nagisa! And you! Look, we, uh, want you to join our war party. You're the only chance we've got. I always knew you were amazing, but that attack a minute ago? Work with us and Koro Sensei's as good as defeated. Hmm. He, he thinks we suck. suck. Come on, seriously? Even if I did join you... Like, sincerely suck. I think we all know it'd be my kill. That's no... <laughs> You're mine now. My life is meaningless. Where'd he run off to? <laughs> Sorry, it's this cave. I felt grimy. <laughs> Did you take a bath? No disrespect, but to be honest, you were so slow and that trap so tedious, I thought, why not make the most of my time and zip over to a hot springs for a nice soothing dip? Just the ticket, too. Healed that nasty wound up like magic. You're not supposed to bathe yourself in a hot spring! <laughs> oh, really? You're strong, Karma, I'll give you that. Quick on your feet, literally and figuratively. Hey, quit trying to wash my back, it's weird! Creep thinks he can just... The trouble is, you let those talents go to your head. If wielded in arrogance, a blade will never touch me. The Demon King isn't felled by a single player, but by a team of skilled warriors working in tandem. Camouflaging yourself was an exceptionally clever move. Why not shroud yourself in the mantle of E-Class next time? I see. You want me to be part of the group, too. Fine, give me my clothes back, and I'll give it some thought. All right, there we go. Damn it, I didn't say yes, I said I'd give it some thought! E-Class proudly welcomes our newest members! What is wrong with you people? And your banner looks like a bad website! And why the stupid dialogue box?! And that's how you drag the Red Devil into being part of your clique. Which brings us that much closer to victory. But I still haven't said yes!